Thanks for coming back and joining me. I'm sitting here getting ready to do a haul video, which with I want to show you my little kitty if I can see him. Oh, come here, you. Oh, here's my baby here. This is Winston. Not Winston. I mean Simon. I'm sorry. Isn't he a cutie? No. So say hi. You guys say hi? No, you're not into all that. Say, nah, I'm not into all that. Well, that's Simon, not Winston. I don't know why I said Winston at first. Winston's our Siamese. That's our little Maine Coon, Simon. So he's the one that gets into all kinds of stuff and basically my baby, I guess. They're both my babies, but he really acts like he thinks I'm his mama, you know. So he's in here now. <laughs> So I wanted to do a haul video for you guys and show you some of the stuff that I had gotten within recently. So, let's see. Okay, so first off, my husband and I went out shopping the one day and we were in Walmart and then I went into Sadie's. 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 Sally's Beauty Supply, that's what I was trying to say. I don't know where that little monkey went to. So, I'm going to show you some of the products that I ended up getting. Alright, so one of the first things I ended up, ended up getting is um, Maybelline, the uh, Master Highlight. I got another color and I got the one in nude and why I got the one in nude was because I thought maybe um, it would be great for the highlight like some have talked about. So I really thought I would be able to use this one really well for a highlight. So there it is, there swatched. And not sure how well you can see it on my hands there. It's right up here. Making all kinds of noise with my bag and over there. There you go. It's not like extreme, but it will give you nice subtle highlights. So I think this is great for just that subtle um, highlight color. And then I haven't done the nails for a long time, and I hear a lot of people talking about these ones. And this is Kiss Gel Fantasy Ready to Wear um, um, Nails. <laughs> Amazing Gel Shine Ultra Smooth Finish. You get 24 of them. So I got these really pretty ones that had some like glitter on them and everything. Thought I'd give them a try. See if I like them or not. I haven't worn anything like these. And I can't even tell you how long. It's been forever, so. With summer coming up, I thought that would be nice spring and summer. So, and then, what else? Oh, okay. When we were in Walmart, if I can get my Walmart stuff out here, I picked up two of these quads of Maybelline. Um, you always hear a lot about these quads, and I do have quite a few of them myself. So I had gotten the Coral Oasis one, and the Copper Chick one, because again, I was thinking of summertime. And the Coral Oasis is really pretty. Some really pretty colors in there. Um, let's see. Sounds like it's gotten windy out there from... It sounds like it. So there's the colors there from Coral Oasis. Very pretty colors. Oops, hold on. Swatched on my hand, which that one does look kind of powdery, but... That's gorgeous when you blend it out. There it is. Very pretty. 
Okay. Good thing I got stocked up on the lights. Because <laughs> I really need them. Uh, this one's the Copper Chick one, which oh, I think is so gorgeous. I think this one I like even better. So... There's the Copper Chick one. Oh my. Yeah, that's really pretty. That one I really like. The colors how they look on there. A little streakage, but that could be my fault from the wipe. So. What are you doing? Nice. Just over by the door. I thought maybe he was going to try and hint around. He wanted out. Alright. Then, you know me, I love the cover girl color the CoverGirl Lip Perfections. I love those. The color, the Maybelline Sensationals are my favorite. And then the CoverGirl Lip Perfections are my second favorite. And this, I'm not sure if it's a new color or not, because I do know there's some new colors that came out. And I had purchased one of them. And I forgot the name already, because I just purchased too many of them lipsticks. But this one's in Yummy Gourmand Gourmandine? Gourmandise. Gourmandive's Yummy Something. And it's in the pink family. I thought that was so pretty. So, so pretty. I don't know what it is. Yummy Something. Very moisturizing lipsticks. Very pretty. Right there it is. Like I said, I'm not sure. Is it Yummy Gourmandized? Gourmandized. You see the word yummy and you see this pink coloring like this, which I'll show you. That'd be the one you want. $3.97 if you're interested. Very pretty. So, that's that. Is there anything else that we got in Wally World? <laughs> Yes, I call it Wally World. Let's try to think. Is that the only two I got? But I've had another one here. But maybe not. No, those are the only ones I got. Okay, that's right. Okay, in Sally's Beauty, in Sally's Beauty, I ended up getting some products which. The same company that did the eyeshadows that I did a review on, the Real Colors, I wanted to get one of their blushes, which I wish I would have picked a different one, because this one might be just a little too much for me. Um, but it's in Rose Gold. And it is very shimmery, which I could see, oh, which these are little, and they but they do have something similar to just a little, it looks like a little almost like the physician's formula, a little, a little mini thing. So there is an opening here that you can go ahead and um, apply your blush and everything. But, um, where do I, oh here we go. And I could tell it looked like, but sometimes you can see some blushes and it looks sparkly or sheen or whatever or something, but it doesn't apply that way. But this is different, so it's rose gold. And as you can see right there already, you can see the gold flecks. So, there it is there. Okay, honey, babe. He says, hurry up. <laughs> Get off. What you doing, huh? Oh, you're going to rub on me. Well, hello. So there it is there. Now, you might be able to see the glitter somewhat, I'm not sure, but it does do the little glitter specks. I don't know about it, but it's like five something for it, so I'll work with it maybe. Hey, what are you doing? I don't know be getting into anything. So, and then this one here is um, 
from Femme Couture. And these blushes looked pretty interesting to me. So I thought, oops, dropped a plastic. This one's in rosy pink. And I thought it was really pretty, so I thought I'd give it a try. Give one of their blushes a try. So this is from the company Femme Couture. Hey, we'll go ahead and he's eating something crunchy on the floor. Yay. So there it is right there. Very pretty. I have to get that plastic thing. I'll have to remember that. And then I had heard Tara. She is known on here as Tar Tara Babies or something like that. Or I don't know. Something like that. And I watch her a lot on YouTube here with a lot of her beauty stuff. And she was talking about, because I love my L'Oreal Infallible eyeshadows. Those are my favorites. I like the color tattoo from Maybelline, but the Infallibles are my most favorite. And she was saying about how the um, Femme Couture had had some, you know. So I was like, oh my gosh, you're kidding me. And I kind of forgot about it until we were in there. And when I was looking at everything, I had found two of them. And these are from the Femme Couture. Hey! He, he, he's whatever with the door here. So, yeah. Pause a moment here. <laughs> Let my cat out. So, this one here, these are the eyeshadows that I was just showing. And this one here is in Pirate? Pirate? Pyrite? Fright? I don't know. Something like that. This is a very pretty color. These are really nice, and they have the stoppers just like the Infallibles. And, as you can see, exactly like the Infallibles, really. So, there's the color. It's like a nice taupey color. And there it is there. Is that not insanely gorgeous? So, if you like the... Um, infallibles. You'll really love these. Just there it is, right there. You can see. That's really pretty, so I can't wait to use that one. And the next one is extremely gorgeous, just I'm not sure, because it seems like there is some glitter, so I'm not really sure. But, um, this one's in Aquamarine. That's what that one is, Aquamarine. I'll show you the other one because I forgot to do that. I do that sometimes, I forget. Yes, baby. There's the other one. Okay, so the Aquamarine, oh my goodness, it is just beautiful. There it is there. Okay, here it is swatched. Isn't that pretty? It's gorgeous. That definitely rings summer. Okay, Simon. So my Boy, when you put that on, wow. So there it is there. The aquamarine. It does have glitter, but boy, is it gorgeous. I love it. And they do have emerald and a purple. I think, I think there's a purple. I know there's emerald and a couple other colors. Sapphire. Can you imagine the sapphire? So I might have to be checking them out and getting some of those. I forget how much these were a piece. But if you love the L'Oreal Infallibles, I'd say definitely go and get you some of the... Uh, it's called Eternal Color Intense Silky Shadow. And it's from the company Femme Couture, and it's in Sally's Beauty. So, alright. don't think I have anything else in here. I think the other stuff's in my box. So this other stuff I have in my box. Um, 
Oh, I had gotten okay. one of the limited edition uh, Revlon, what are these ones? Super Lustrous Revlon, and I got Jungle Peach. There's a limited edition out right now, Jungle Peach, Snow Peach, I see Amethyst, and I forget what the other one is. There, there's two more, maybe, but there's several of them. And um, this one I got was Jungle Peach, because I thought it was just perfect. So, there it is there very pretty peachy color. really like it. So I'm glad I picked that one up. almost forgot about that. Okay, and then from Sephora, I had ordered the... From Sephora, I had ordered the new uh, Urban Decay Flushed Naked. I ordered, ordered, ordered. <laughs> I ordered the native one. I have the other one and I love it. So I wanted to get this one because it had the different colors. So it's Naked Flush Native. Okay, and there is the colors which will cover that up. And the blush is more of a brighter pink. This highlighter is even better in, than the that was in the other one. It is gorgeous. Love it. And, whoops, the bronzer, it seems almost the same. Maybe there's a little difference, but I love my other one, and this one I love even more, I think. So, um, now I've heard someone post up about there was, um, it was quite powdery. I've only swatched it. I haven't used a brush yet, so I can't really say for sure. I just know with my finger and swatching it that way, I haven't really had much of a problem. So, um, but here I'm going to go in the bronzer. There it is there. It's a matte color. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to figure out where to put it at. Right there. And then the highlighter, which is lovely. That's the highlighter there. But especially when you put it on. Wait. I was trying to see where it was at. Can you see that? Let me. Let me do it on my other hand. Well, darn it, it's gorgeous. There it is, because it just does a nice sheen. It's not like pow in your face, but it does a nice sheen. So there's the highlight. And then the gorgeous blush. Which it's like a uh, bright pink, something pink. There it is on my finger. <laughs> so you can see it. It is very pretty. There it is there. So that I got in or on Sephora so um, then I just got some of my little point thingies that you get I got the Urban Decay Lip Gloss Naked I got it in um, I had showed it in one of my other videos uh, Love Child so I have it in the Love Child. That one there. It's just a little baby small thing. Just a little baby. So I ended up getting that with my points. 
Um, and then, hey you, where is my other thing here? Um, and then I got this I figured I'd try because I have seen it different times and I was intrigued by it. It's the Photo Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. Uh, luminizing oil free. So I got a little thing. Eight bucks for this guy though. Crazy. But I mean there is a not too bad as of of a mountain there, but still. Crazy. I'm gonna put a little on my hand. Seems rather thick when you put it on your hand. It's really different. But when you rub it out it does turn illuminating. See right there's the consistency right there. But then you see the luminosity, don't you? So yeah, that's different. So I thought I'd give it a try. And then some of my little samples. I got the CC cream sample, which they fell out. But these are CC cream samples. Ah. And they are from Peter Thomas Roth. So I got those those um, samples. I got a sample of I don't know if I'm going to pronounce this right, but it's Dior Jador. Is that how you say it? I don't know, but it smells good. That's why I like getting them little samples like that. It smells really good. And then I got a sample of Fresh Soy Face Cleanser from the company Fresh. I wanted to try that. I've been interested in trying that, so I believe that is it. Yeah, I believe that is it. Sorry right, for you. Thanks so much for joining me and let me show you what I had gotten in my haul. And um, just if you um, want to follow me, you can follow me on Twitter like me on Facebook and you can um, or also don't forget to subscribe to my channel almost forgot to say that <laughs> and um, I don't know what I oh I do have a couple more things coming so I'll probably have another video talking about some other stuff but that will be a little bit later so yeah I need to clean myself off here because I have loads and loads of <laughs> Just, I said it's so funny you can tell when when you do YouTube videos and especially for beauty because you look like a colorful rainbow so all right thanks so much beauties for joining me um, I appreciate each and every one of you thank you for all my new subscribers too thank you so much and um, yeah until next time I will see you then so take care everybody bye bye mm -hmm.